Let's make my dream dress. Yes, this is a dress I have been dreaming about practically my whole sewing life. I have always wanted to create couture. High fashion, super fancy couture. To me, fashion is art and I want to create art. Uh but honestly, I'm just one person with undiagnosed ADHD and a room in my house that I can kind of sew in. So there's not a huge team of people to help me. So when I mess up, it's on me. Anyway, like any other couture look, it all starts with a base. And then we build and hand sew on top of that. Did I sew the whole thing together, put it on the mannequin, and forget to put the saran wrap on? Correct. But we took it off, put the saran wrap on so I don't accidentally hand sew it to the mannequin. And then got to work cutting the leaves out. What is the inspiration behind this, you ask? I'll be glad to tell you. It is in fact just vibes. Truly, I was feeling a seasonal depression vibe. Which for me means hand sew an impossible gown. The kind of red carpet dress that you see articles written about that's like five hundred hours and 20 people worked on this yeah that but i'm one person which means it's me i'm doing all the hand sewing so as you can imagine most of this will be a hand sewing video i did at one point decide to let's take a break from this and go outside and touch grass or feed the goats or see the horses whatever but that gave me a great idea to make horse tack which immediately i regret because i was instantly intimidated by just how much work it takes so i gave up on that and went back to hand sewing which leads me to a new segment in these vlogs called fac the daily faqs it's time to play First question, do you sell your dresses? No, I don't. Follow-up question is why? These are one of a kind. Usually made from dead stock fabrics or hard to find fabrics. Most of the time made from fabric scraps. There is one in existence. I just can't make a ton. The next question is, do you take customs? Also a no. Though I'm grateful for the interest. I just get paralyzed with the fear that I'm gonna make something and you're gonna hate it and you're gonna tell everybody that I'm horrible. I care way too much about other people's opinions to be making custom dresses. And number three is, oh, I forgot that one. Anyway, here's a corgi break. If you're still with us, I am, yes, still hand sewing. How long did this take? A month and a half to make. If I didn't take two weeks to be paralyzed by making tack, it probably would have taken just a month. Still, a month of working on this every day, eight hours a day, hand sewing. But I do think it was worth it because this is how she came out. It is everything I thought it was going to be. And more. And more. I am obsessed with this dress. Hands down my favorite look. I need to see this on a red carpet, please. And yeah, did I do a good job of bringing my dream dress to life? Let me know. Until next time, bye!